Hi everybody, it's Dawn from Crafting on the Green and this is card number two from the January craft kit. Um, the craft kit is using the Kangaroo and Company stamps and dies, so hopefully you have everything in front of you ready to go. This one's a birthday card and to make this card you will need a Whisper White card base, a Whisper White layer and a Balmy Blue mat. So the first thing I'm going to do is stick all these together. So to take your chosen glue or maybe some tear and tape if you prefer. And we're going to stick the Whisper White on top of the Balmy Blue. And then same again, but I'm going to stick the Balmy Blue onto the card base. And there we go, <clears throat> just like that. So nice and straightforward to start with. So next we're going to do some stamping, colouring and die cutting. So we're going to take our memento and first of all I'm going to stamp this cheeky chappy right here. Now I'm just doing this on a scrap piece of Whisper White that I've got. Um, you have got some included in your kit, so on the first card I mentioned cutting an A4 piece into quarters, so just use another quarter. Okay, I think I, I dipped him a bit too soon, I'll do him again, there we go. Um, so we only need one of him, ignore that one. Then we're going to do a butterfly. Um, now you're also going to do about seven of the present bundles but I've already done these so that you don't have to watch me cutting out seven lots of uh, <laughs> presents so uh, I'm going to use my crumb cake dark and light and I'm just going to colour in my little kangaroos So like I say, you want to do about seven of the presents. You may also want to do more or you might want to do less. But I would say start with seven and you'll see how they build up. Obviously the choice is yours. You'll have lots of extra Whisper White to play with, so no reason why you can't cut out a few more and have a play. not being particularly neat at the bottom of this kangaroo because he's going to be covered up. Right, that's them. I'm going to add some light Rococo rose on the end of their noses and in their ear. Okay. And then for the butterfly, I want to colour him in balmy blue. Now you don't get a, um, I'm going to use just the Stampin' Right because I want him just to be the same colour as the card. I don't, I don't want to play with different colouring. And because there's not much detail on there, that's fine. Um, and I'm also just going to take the, the black Stampin' Right marker and just colour in its body. There we go. Right, so now I'm just going to die cut these out. Um, okay. So, pop that on there. So, you're going to need 
and we're going to need we need slightly well the half kangaroo the full little kangaroo and the butterfly I'll see if I can line these up without using masking tape. But if it keeps moving, then I will use some masking tape. Usually once you have it sandwiched, it stays in place. So I don't always use masking tape. over there okay so we've got our cheeky little chappies and a little butterfly so here's the presents I've already got as I say I've done seven of them all different colors you can color them however you wish I just didn't think you'd want to sit and watch me cut out and color seven of them so what we're going to do is make a pile of presents um, so you want to decide which presents you want to go at the back which ones you want to go at the front so I think I might do something like oh, that and then I'm going to pop these two on the front so I'm just going to use some glue and get these straight on there. <clears throat> so you can kind of arrange them as you wish. Um, I'd recommend not leaving them too far apart, maybe overlapping them ever so slightly. Maybe that's a bit too close. There we go. We want to try and make a mountain, but we also want to make sure there's not lots of gaps left over. Um, in fact, what I should have done is started at the top. But that's okay. There we go. And that one for the top. Okay, so we've got our little mountain of prezzies then what I'm going to do is pop our kangaroo on a dimensional somewhere nearish to the top and the other two presents will also go on dimensionals. So I think I'm going to do, oh, not there, pink one. I don't want to stick the pink one on top of him. I want the pink one just under him so that it will just cover him. And then the same for this present as well. I don't want to stick it on top. I just want to, to sort of layer it over. So that's all our prezzies done. Now we're going to stick on this other cheeky chappy. Or chappess. Who knows? So I'm going to use a dimensional and just pop it at the bottom. <clears throat> right. <clears throat> Excuse me. So the next thing I've got here is a greeting from the Many Messages stamp set. Um, if you've not seen that one, I'll show you quickly. It's this one, it's one big stamp. 
and it comes with one big die so you can stamp this and when you cut it out you get lots of different sayings all in one go definitely worth a look <clears throat> but the one I'm going to use is hooray it's your birthday and I'm going to pop that on dimensionals just up here so we'll just use a couple of those I'm just going to pop it about there. And now we've got our little butterfly. So what I'm going to do, I'm not going to put it on a dimensional. I'm just going to stick it onto the corner. So I'm just going to use a little bit of glue. Only right on the edge. Oh. As you see, I've only popped the glue right there. And in fact, I'm going to use my tweezers because he's a little bit small. And then I'm just going to pop him just there. There we go. And once the glue takes it, it will hold him in place. Lovely. So, last thing we need to do on the card is I'm going to use my ivory blender blend pen. And I'm just going to give a little bit of shadow. Just under here, something like that. Oh, I'm trying not to knock the butterfly off. So there we go. That is card number two from your January craft kit. I hope you've enjoyed making it, and I will see you soon for Jan uh, for January card craft kit card three. It's getting hard to say. <laughs> see you soon. Bye bye.